So if you have a lithium battery, like any M car will, and for some reason it died, mine wasn't started for a year and a half, that would do it. The manufacturers put this bypass on it that your charger will not even recognize when it's dead. But there's still power. So what you do is you take the battery apart. Okay. There's five bolts on top for this one. One, two, three, four, five. And then you got to disconnect these plugs. Nope. These plugs. Unscrew that. And take the 10 millimeter bolts off. This all, The shell comes off. And you have to charge, put the charge overnight. So this is where the factor ones are with, that you can access from the top of the car. These are the ones you want to charge. And it did work. It's fully charged overnight and it worked. All right, so bad news. The switch inside will not connect to the terminals. Should have checked that before I put it back together. But we got to take it apart again. Okay, the lid came off. This can come off. Now we got to flip it back over. So this switch is disconnected. So we are at 14.29 volts in the cells total. So we are good, except it's not connecting from here to here. So what we're gonna do is unplug these two. For a few minutes. And then plug them back in and hopefully that works. It's supposed to activate this. It's supposed to connect right here. They're not connecting. But as soon as I plug the two computer module, I mean the brains back up, clunk did happen. There is power, there's blue light, and we're gonna connect. So ladies and gentlemen, we fixed the battery and saved some serious money. Put in A60. That's what it should be. Next. Watch this. This is going to be awesome. Good battery. We are back in business, baby. And we got a double of cold crank and M's that we need. We'll take it. So put it back together. You screw in the terminals first when you put the lid on. That way the top is secured to the battery. Then you flip it over and do the four corner bolts on the bottom with this thing. Now that you're put together, you gotta put the last bolts in. There's five of these. And that's it, you're back in business. Well, no, I lied. These are important not to get direct access. You screw them on like that, by hand first. And then what I used was, maybe it's something different, but it's what I used. You just put it into two holes and you screw it further in, all the way in until it's flush. And then you can put it back in the car. Well, it's official. Just saved myself two grand by fixing my lithium battery. It was dead for a year and a half. And now it works. Yeah, right, right. Look at that. Yeah, baby.